I, I was the only female doctor working full-time in that organization. Right. That says a lot. And the reason that none of the other women did it was because they couldn't. They yeah. just felt that they could not balance their family. They couldn't balance the demands. They right. couldn't treat their patients like they needed right. to. And after a while, after a while, I just said, I can't do this. I can't right. continue to be a good doctor and just have the pressure of, and then feel that I couldn't be with my family. Right. My medical director at that time told me, Jen, your first job is as a doctor. And if you, if your patients need you on a Saturday, when you're at home with your kids, then you get up and leave and go take care of your patients. And I said, I'm sorry, but that's not, you know, I'm doing that now for my patients, but I'm not doing that for them the way they wanted it to be right. done, right? It has to be a balance. And when I'm when I was working, you know, in the hospital so, and uh, of so course those are all the ins the, and outs. Exactly. Those are the little <laughs> things. Of course for other medications, if it's really, really expensive, then it does benefit to go through insurance. For the people who don't have insurance right now, what I'm trying to do is find um, the lowest cost medication for what the condition they have. Right. Um, and then there are programs like GoodRx, and there's another discount uh, card that will give people uh, some discounts on their medications. Right. So you can actually help them I find can help them. Yep. what they need. Yep, absolutely. I knew that I wanted to be a doctor when I was four years old. I have no idea how. I have no. I, I just. I remember going to see my pediatrician and thinking that he was the best person ever. You know that he could cure me and do. And and there was something about what he did that I just figured. You know, I want to do that. I want to be able to help people and make people feel better and you know make someone that feels sick you know feel good again. Um, so I just decided at the age of four that's what I was gonna do, and that's what I managed to just get in my head and I did it, right? I mean, it wasn't easy going, you know, sitting and studying for hours on end in right. medical school. Oh,